This integral behind me might seem the most difficult integral in all of calculus, but it isn't, and I'll show you why. We cannot proceed as the usual way, finding the antiderivative of this function, because as you can see, it's too way complicated. We cannot do that, but we have a clever method, and I'll show you how to proceed and solve this crazy integral. So, as you can see, first notice that we have pi and its opposite, minus pi, so pi with a minus sign in front of it. So, if this function is odd, basically if it has a symmetry with respect to the origin, so if it goes like this on one side, uh, it goes the opposite way on the other, if we want to find the definite integral, so the area under this curve, as you can see, the areas are equal, but opposite in sign, so it, they will cancel out, and the result is zero. So we need to check whether this function is odd. The function is odd if f of x, f of minus x equals minus f of x. So if we put minus x here, cosine of minus x is cosine of x, so this remains unchanged, whereas this part, uh, minus x cubed, is minus x cubed and sine of minus x cubed is minus sine of x cubed and we can also bring the minus outside so this equals zero and we did it in a minute or so.